thank you for coming back to my channel. I'm Stephanie, if you are new here. Today we are going to be going over a simple recipe in this new air fryer. So today's video is going to be sponsored by Blazent Air Fryers. today's video we are going to be making a personal pan pizza in the air fryer but we're going to be making a barbecue chicken pizza so I have my crust and everything ready for today's video This is what it looks like. I just used regular pizza crust. If you want to use an already pre-made crust, you can go ahead and do that also. But this is what we're gonna be using today. And also, I'm going to be using one of my accessory kits that I have listed down below in the description. If you guys are interested in this air fryer, I also will leave a link for you guys uh, to purchase one of these air fryers. You're gonna to wanna to spray the bottom of your pan. And I'm going to just take my pizza crust and throw it right in my pan. All right, with this air fryer, you have an option to do a preheat. Preheat right here. I'm going to bring my temp down to 370 because that's what my recipe is gonna be going for. I'm gonna bring it to two minutes and that is what we are gonna preheat our air fryer to. And then I'm going to press start. So now that my preheat is done, I'm going to be spraying my pizza crust. And we're gonna put this in the air fryer for just a little bit because we wanna cook this first before we add any sauce or any cheese or anything to this. So we're gonna put it back in the air fryer. We're gonna set our air fryer to 370 and then we are gonna cook the crust for four minutes. Now that my crust is done, I'm going to be adding my barbecue sauce on top. And then whatever you have for leftover chicken, you can use for this recipe. So you can add it as much as you want. All right. I'm just gonna add a bunch of mozzarella cheese on top. And then I'm gonna add some salt and pepper on top also. Okay, I'm gonna set that back into the air fryer and we are gonna cook this for, and turn it back on. We're gonna set our air fryer to 370 and we are gonna cook it for five minutes. And I will come back and I will show you what it looks like. Okay, with this air fryer, you have the on button and then it has a lot of other buttons that you can pick from when you are wanting to cook something special with your air fryer. So we have the air fry button, we have a preheat, air rose, defrost, keep warm, dehydrate, shake, and reheat. One of the things that is cool with this air fryer, it has an optional shake remind button, and you can use that if you want a reminder on when to shake your food in between uh, their cook time. Also with the preheat button, that also helps with getting things started before you cook your meal in the air fryer. It also has the temp or time control on this side, temp on this side, and then it also has a keep warm button on 
the display. So with this air fryer, it comes with a basket just like this, and then the tray comes out, and this is what the inside of the air fryer looks like. This air fryer right here is a seven cord air fryer. If you go online, they will have many different other options for you guys to pick from. I will show you on the screen right here some of the options that you can um, have. And then also they have recipes and stuff on their website. When you receive your air fryer, you get a user manual. You also get a magnet that you can put on your fridge and it gives you time and temps of what you can do to cook other things in the air fryer. And then they also give you a nice size cookbook with their air fryer so that's really nice and it has a lot of references and different things in there if you guys are interested i also have my own ebook and that will be listed down below and i have pretty similar recipes in my ebook uh down in the description so go check that out so hopefully you guys liked today's video and you enjoyed this new air fryer hopefully that was fun for you guys to watch and learn something new with a different product um if you guys are interested like i said below you can check out this down in the description and you guys can go get one of your own hopefully you guys like today's video don't forget to give me a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next one